Well, we've made it to December, and obviously December is the start of the official summer season. And what a start in Victoria. So we, uh, we expect to have hot days in summer, and what have we just experienced, which has been significant rain across most of the state, and uh, in some parts of the state, rain that is unprecedented and broken records from years and years past. So from that, I suppose what it does tell us though is that whatever the emergency is, the flood, the storm, the fire, we live in that environment, that could be the case. So we still need to be prepared, don't we? And one of the things that we really need to focus on is where do you get the information for you to make a good decision? And uh, we in Victoria have made sure that we've got one website, one app, uh, one process to publish our information, and that's Vic Emergency. And it's time now to make sure that you update your phone, you update your information, you update uh, and download the app if you need it, and fine tune how you use those tools, because there are things you can turn on and off to help you make decisions. And I think that's important. It's no good on the night before the storm, it's no good on the day of the flood, and it's certainly not acceptable to wait for the fire to be at your front door before you start to think about where to get information. So take this time, it's cooler this week, we've had rain, we've had floods, some communities are still flooded, to actually fine tune what you need to do to make a good decision. And that's to know where you get the information from and how to use it. So that's the message at the moment. Uh, we're in a quieter time, we're in a, in a, in, in not in a, a, a hot period, uh, it's fairly mild, and we've had rain, and let's think about those uh, communities that have got rain, water all around them. And, uh, and if we haven't got that, that's a good thing, but for those that have had it, it's been quite devastating. So thank you.